Russian ally Belarus has deployed tank units to the Ukrainian border, according to an announcement from the Belarus Defense Ministry. It happened after the Kursk operation of the Ukrainian army. As part of the strengthening of the border groupings of the troops, tanks of one of the mechanized brigades of the armed forces of Belarus are deployed on the border with Ukraine. The press service of the Ministry of Defense of Belarus released information about this. The units of one of the mechanized formations are ready to perform the assigned tasks, and the military equipment is loaded onto the railway transport and starts to move together to the designated areas, it was pointed out in the information. President Alexander Lukashenko said air defense forces destroyed several of, about a dozen, Ukrainian drones after they violated Belarusian airspace in the eastern Mogilev region bordering Russia. He said others were later destroyed near the Russian city of Yaroslavl. Earlier on Saturday, the Russian Defense Ministry said Russian forces had intercepted six drones in the Yaroslavl region. Considering the situation in Ukraine and in the Kursk region of Russia, the commander-in-chief of the armed forces has given orders to reinforce troops in the Gomel and Moser tactical areas in order to respond to such provocations, Defense Minister Viktor Krenin said. Special Operations Forces, Ground Troops and Rocket Forces, including Polonas and Iskander Systems, have been tasked with deploying to the designated areas. He said Belarus regarded the violation of its airspace as a provocation and was ready to respond. The Belarusian Ministry of Foreign Affairs has issued a statement strongly condemning the actions of Ukrainian armed formations in Russia's Kursk Oblast. It is with deep concern and pain that Belarus has learned about the events that have been recently taking place in Kursk Oblast of the Russian Federation. We strongly condemn the actions of the Ukrainian armed formations, which have gone on this senseless adventure, aggravating the conflict in our region, the statement reads. The Belarusian Ministry of Foreign Affairs expressed support and solidarity with the residents of Kursk Oblast. We express our sincere condolences to the families and relatives of the victims and wish a speedy recovery to the injured, the statement reads.